Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Sammy and I make mommy lifestyle and Leo content. And today I am here with a nursery tour video. And this is actually my favorite room in our home. And so I just wanted to give you a brief overview before we start showing some detail. So these hooks were from Hobby Lobby and the theme of his nursery is moon and stars and I don't know if that would be considered sweet dreams or really what it is it's kind of just our own style we've just kind of collected things over the time um, that we were pregnant and we really love the way that it came out I do plan to get a cube shelf for right there just for storage purposes but I love all of these things hanging here that's the outfit that we brought him home from the hospital in and that blanket also came home with him and then that little hat is so cute. It actually never fit his head, but it's too cute to put away, so it's just hanging on the hook. And then this little chair was a gift from Oliver's great aunt. It's hand painted, it has his name and letters and numbers on it, and it's super cute. And we've already taken some photos in it, so we love and treasure that gift so much. And then we have this little cute cloud outline and I think I got that at Hobby Lobby and it lights up and because we don't have a ton of shelving in here I just have left it on the window ledge but it's super cute this spot right here is probably my favorite in the nursery the his name was a gift from his aunt and it's beautiful I just put it on with some command strips and we loved that touch to the nursery the crib was actually left here by the previous owners. Their child, well, they had a couple of kids. Their kids had outgrown it, and they asked if we would like to have it, and we did not have a crib yet, so we said yes. And the bedding is actually from Amazon, but it's the Ivanka Trump line. I didn't know that when I registered for it, but a dear friend got this for us as a gift for our baby shower, and we love it, and the mobile came with it as well. Oliver loves that mobile. He'll lay in the crib and just smile and coo at it. <laughs> and he really, really loves that. So we really love that gift. And then this corner over here, we usually have a rocking chair um, in the corner. But if you guys follow me on Instagram, you know the struggles that we have had with Oliver sleeping lately. So it's actually in our master bedroom but it normally sits in that corner there. So over here, we just have this little nightstand and I actually got the nightstand and the dresser as a, um, it was like a Facebook yard sale find and I purchased it for, I think it was like $70 <laughs> and just they were really old and white and <laughs> they were kind of ugly. So I painted them when I was about six months pregnant and um, we purchased the hardware there, but we've actually had some trouble with the hardware. It's from Amazon and we have tried every single type of screw and screws with anchors and we've tried, we've literally tried everything I feel like, um, and they just keep stripping out for some reason. So we have, um, decided that we're probably just going to have to order new hardware and you will see when I move over to the dresser just how bad it actually is and it drives me just a little bit crazy <laughs> but the lamp was also left here by the previous owners they asked if we wanted it since we told them our our the color of the room and everything went perfectly and we said yes sure why not <laughs> um, when we moved into this house they were still moving out and they just, I think they just wanted to be done moving. So anything that we wanted to have, we got to keep. <laughs> um, and then the little picture frame says, dream big little one. I believe I got that from TJ Maxx or Home, Home Goods. Um, I don't remember for sure. But anyway, from one of those stores. And then that little basket just has socks in it. It's hard to keep this kid in socks. He grows so fast. Now he's in 12 month socks and I think we're going to have to 
bump him up before too long because they're almost too small. And then I have two pairs of shoes on the window ledges there. One is the pair of shoes that we announced his gender with and then the other pair was a gift. The little sign is from Hobby Lobby and then that little ornament hanging above it was a gift from his aunt and we actually didn't even hang it on the Christmas tree. <laughs> we just hung it in his room and then we'll hang it in the, on the Christmas tree next year but we love the way that it fit in with the decor in here so we just left it for the time being <laughs> when she gave it to us. And then this little sign over here is from Hobby Lobby. It was one of the first purchases that I made and I really, really love that sign. <laughs> and then down here you will see is Oliver's Storytime Crate. And all of those books in there were gifts um, from his baby shower. We requested that people give books instead of cards and they wrote little notes in there. So every time we read him a story, we also read the note and just remind him how much he's loved. And then these little plaques here, I got these from, I think, Big Lots. And they're just super cute. You can't really tell, but they're almost a navy blue. There's so much light that comes in here that it kind of messes with the lighting a little. But that little board over there was a gift from um, Oliver's aunt that made the name above his crib. And I have it turned around because it has all of his personal information on there. So I didn't want to um, ignore the privacy, but... Um, it's super cute. It measures all the way up to just above six feet tall and it has his birth length on there along with his name. And then this area right here, we got this rug from Amazon and honestly we haven't been too impressed. We purchased it because it was fairly affordable and it seemed like it would be soft but the little like, I don't know what those are called, threads or whatever, they fall out all around the carpet and it's really annoying so I have to vacuum it all the time. So it's not the best quality rug but it works for what we want it for. <laughs> and then the horse, um, the rocking horse was a gift from my aunt. Her little boys played with it and she wanted to give it to someone who would get use out of it and it's just so cute. It's like a vintage rocking horse and I didn't want to paint it or anything. I just love the way that it looks. And then the giant elephant was a gift from my mom. And the moose, I think, came from my grandma. And then I'm not honestly sure where the little elephant came from. <laughs> We've gotten so many over the course of time. And then there's his closet, but I'm not going to show you what's in there right now because um, my sister is getting ready to have a baby and her baby shower is this weekend, so I don't want to spoil any surprises that are tucked away in there. And then over here, we have these two bins. Um, this one has clothes that he's grown out of that I just need to pack away. And then that bin has tons and tons and tons of stuffed animals. He has gotten so many stuffed animals over the course of time. And then of course you guys know how much I love the Ubi pail. But here you can really see what I was talking about with the hardware on, um, on the dresser. It just strips out and over time it's just all fallen off and it drives me crazy. I tried tried everything and nothing seems to work so we've given up with it at this point and then the changing pad was just from Walmart and the covers from Walmart and they didn't have any that fit along with my theme when I purchased everything so I've just kept that one on there and it really hasn't mattered that much and then you can see I, I just leave a diaper out there usually when I change Oliver he wants to just like roll all around <laughs> So I'm constantly trying to wrangle him and he likes to play with the diaper. It entertains him and it keeps him still long enough for me to change his diaper so I just leave one there. But the little teddy bear plays peekaboo and that is a gift from his great grandma and he really didn't understand it that much until recently and now he really really loves it. And then the wipe warmer is there. You guys know how much I love that thing. <laughs> And then this little sign says, hi, I'm new here. And that is from, uh, I think, Hobby Lobby as well. So this, these canvases were the whole inspiration for this room. And I purchased them on Amazon. And when we brought Oliver home, he was so enamored <laughs> with those canvases. He was just in love. And he would stare, like, stare and stare at them for 
I, if I would have left him there for an hour, he would have stared at them for an hour. For some reason, he just loved them. And I think they're so pretty. They were super affordable. And they were the whole inspiration for this space. So I definitely think it was a wise purchase. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Like I said, this is my favorite room in the house. And I love how much light comes in here. He's still not sleeping in here. Um, but will be shortly. We are waiting on some room darkening blinds because otherwise he would be awake at about 5 a.m. <laughs> so I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Definitely click that subscribe button and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.